Hi, welcome to a video abstract for our paper, Overloading the Nodes, Rocked RPRPs, Non-Set AAD, and Order Resilient Channels. This is a joint work of my advisor, Jean-Paul de Gabriel, and myself. We start by introducing a new security notion for variable input length tweakable ciphers mapping a pair of strings to a pair of strings. We call this new notion Rock Pseudo Random Permutation, or RPRP for short. The RPRP notion lies right in between the PRP notion, where the adversary is tasked with distinguishing between tweakable cipher and ideal cipher, given full access to the N ciphering algorithm, and the SPRP notion, where the adversary has the same task, but in addition has full access to the deciphering algorithm. In the RPRP game, the adversary has the same task, and is given full access to the enciphering but only partial access to the deciphering algorithm. We show how to construct efficient RPRPs by presenting the UIV construction, which consists only of equal block cipher and variable output length PRF. As I said, RPRPs are a notion built for variable input length equal ciphers, which one can use to construct AEAD schemes using the encode then encipher paradigm. Since RPRPs are weaker primitive than SPRPs, we can use them to build AAD schemes more efficiently. First of such schemes we present is the encode and encipher scheme, which you can see on the screen. If the underlying tweakable cipher is a RPRP, ET scheme will be misuse resistant secure. Since RPRP is an asymmetric notion, we also explore the option of the encryption using the deciphering algorithm and the decryption using the enciphering algorithm. So we arrived at the encode and decipher construction. It turns out if the underlying equal cipher is a RPRP, ETD scheme will be secure against release of unverified plain text. We consider the following variant of the ETE construction, where one encrypts the nonce during the encryption, and during the decryption uses the nonce provided to the decryption algorithm as a redundancy for the authenticity check. That gave rise to a new different AAD priority we call the nonce set AAD where instead of a single nonce, a nonset is provided uh, to the decryption algorithm and one checks if the decrypted nonce is in the provided nonset. In comparison to conventional nonce-based AAD syntax, nonset AAD decryption algorithm returns a nonce message pair if the decryption was successful. The nonset AAD syntax proves useful in the setting of network protocols that run over unreliable transport, such as DTLS or QUIC, where the non set roughly corresponds to the window mechanism of those protocols. Finally, we present a generic construction that transforms any non set AAD to a secure channel that can have many desired channel functionalities, for example, protecting against replays, deciding how much reordering to tolerate, etc. This construction is much simpler to understand and analyze than, for example, Quick, and can be adapted to any required functionality. For any of these functionalities, the security of the channel is guaranteed by the security of the underlying non AAD schemes. Thank you, we hope to see you in the live version of our talk.